since pretty much everyone and their mother is talking about it, I wanted to express my thoughts on the OGL. You can read the original Gizmodo article and its follow-up, you can see various lawyer analysis of the document, you can even read the whole document online if you want. Mark Humes released his video yesterday and he recapped it all quite nicely and his take is especially poignant to me because I'm like him on a smaller scale, so I can really empathize. Anyway, what's going to happen with the channel? My stream is free so it's not under OGL, it's under the fan content policy, so it's going to keep on going. In any case, I'm not gonna stop it because me and my players have been playing it for like three close to four years and we don't want to stop it we want to finish it we're very close because my business and my livelihood doesn't depend on DD, i am not significantly affected by this but it still hurts i feel for those creators on my level and on higher levels especially those whose livelihood is tied to DD. i wanted to be that at some point and i even hope to make a little profit on it all of my current projects that are somehow related to DD and ogl are on pause Mostly because I want to wait it out and see how it feels, not because I'm afraid of being sued. I'm pretty sure I can write it so it's currently not enforceable. My next campaign was already planned to be running on the Advanced 5th Edition system. I already bought the books for it, but currently, as it was previously, that plan is still hypothetical. I've already started planning and laying out my own system that was supposed to be riffing on D&D Essentials, but I'm now going to probably rewrite it and make it more my thing. I wanted it to be something that is very different from D&D, but still approachable to people who know the biggest role-playing game on the planet, but right now, as far as the future holds, I don't know what it'll be. So that's it for me. I hope you still enjoy the content on this channel. We'll see you in the next video, and hopefully this next year clears out some crud in the industry.